What is going on, everybody? Uh, hope everybody's doing well. What's going on, Tommy? Uh, I always look forward to, to watching your videos. <laughs> you always uh, such enthusiasm. You always make sure I'm awake. Uh, but no, I uh, hope everybody is uh, having a great week so far. Uh, July 4th is coming up. Uh, first, got some updates. Uh, my wife got a job. Uh, finally, uh, Tuesday, she got a phone call. She got offered the position. She went in Thursday, filled out all the hire, the new hire stuff. And she's slated to start, uh, July. What is it? The seventh. <clears throat> uh, so that's some good news. Uh, Got quite a bit of stuff to go through. Uh, it's going to be a long video, fair warning you. Uh, <clears throat> so if you start this and you get to the one minute mark and you finally hear me say that, <clears throat> it's going to be a long video. Uh, first, uh, got a package from Sick Defer 2024. Chris uh, told me it was on the way. He told me I didn't have to do a video because uh, I knew everything that was in it. Um, however, I did want to show everybody uh, what he did send. Uh, because it is greatly appreciated. Uh, I did go ahead and open it because, like I said, I know everything that was in it. Uh, but uh, get on to that first. Uh, this is out of 2010 Gridiron Gear, the NFL Nation dual jersey of Noshan, numbered 90 of 100. And I've got stuff spread out all over my desk. And then the dual patch, uh, two color, two color, sick card. And that's numbered 19 of 25. Told me he got those in a group break and wanted to uh, send them my way. Uh, and then out of uh, Sage, a Ronnie Hillman autograph. Hoping they start kind of using him a little bit more of a change of pace. Uh, and then uh, Upper Deck Rookie FX, uh, Legends in the Making jersey of Terrell Davis. I do have this, but as everybody knows, this will go into the collection, and the other one will move to the Broncos uh, collection. Snap case of uh, base and inserts. I have not had a chance to look through this, Chris. Um, been spending a lot of time on the other thing, uh, which I'll get to. Uh, only a few people know about what the other thing is that I'm referring to. <clears throat> but uh, we were talking one night on the phone, and... Uh, Everybody complains about not knowing what to pick me up uh, from the or for the Terrell Davis collection. Uh, as I've said in previous videos, I don't have as much as what you think I do, uh, especially from a base and certain parallel perspective. Um, I will touch on a pretty big milestone uh, here in just a minute, but a couple other cards that he picked up off of Com C. Uh, this is out of uh, Collector's Edge uh, Masters, the Sentinels. Acetate, it's number 10 of 500. I know I don't have that one. And this is a pretty sweet card. Uh, this was done uh, through Redemption. Uh, I don't know what year it is. It's number 34 of 1,000, but the Dragon Slayers uh, foil. I don't know why my camera is bouncing, but it needs to stop. And then out of 2,000, Topps Chrome, Refractage. Sweet. You'll see a lot of refracted here in a little bit. And uh, some of you may remember the video uh, from this film, Not Yet Rated, um, of the package I sent him. I sent him the Reggie White of this. Uh, the only one I'm missing now is the blue. So if anybody stumbles across the blue, uh, let me know. But 97 Pinnacle Certified Mirror Red. Gorgeous card. So, Chris, thanks again, my friend. I do appreciate it. I know you said I didn't have to do a video, but I did anyways. So, uh, thanks for that. Uh, I still have a couple things here uh, for you to send out uh, eventually. But uh, on to a few eBay pickups. Uh, this is out of uh, 99 uh, Playoff. This is the Checklist on card. OCA addiction, which is what I love about Terrell Davis. Most of his cards are on card. Uh, checklist autograph. 
And I've been holding off picking up one of these for a while because 99% of the autos have started to fade. And this one's pretty clean. And then out of uh, 2013, exquisite, uh, exquisite endorsements. First time TD's been an exquisite. Hate that he's in his Georgia stuff, but got to have it. 19 of 125 on card. So pretty sweet. Uh, with these two and a few other ones I'll show here in just a minute, I'm up to 188 on the autograph uh, front. So that's not the big milestone. Uh, I know I've said it in the past. Uh, funds have been limited, but I always have kind of like a slush fund uh, for uh, the possibility of instances <coughs> that may arise. I stumbled across an eBay seller uh, a few weeks ago uh, and inquired uh, if he had more Terrell Davis stuff based on the listings that he had, and of course he uh, did. Uh, his collection was a, a thousand plus cards, uh, including uh, jerseys, patches, autos, uh, base inserts, parallels, and uh, Rufus Biker one two three Jeremy. Uh, we started corresponding via email and uh, actually talked to him on the phone uh, to kind of get some things finalized. Uh, I really do appreciate Jeremy. I know he'll watch this uh, for taking the opportunity and letting me kind of cherry pick uh, the memorabilia and the autos that I needed for the collection. Uh, of that thousand plus, I added uh, close to 350 cards. Uh, to the TD collection that I didn't have. Uh, so I'm now officially at 51% uh, owned uh, owned of all Terrell Davis cards uh, produced. Uh, as I always throw out the caveat, that's obtainable cards, uh, number uh, serial number five and higher. Um, but as you all know, I have quite a few one-on-ones though as well. Uh, and I have some that... Uh, at least from the auto front, aren't listed as far as on Beckett is concerned because they're redemptions and things along those lines. But, Jeremy, thanks again for the pleasant, easy transaction. Uh, really do appreciate it. This will just kind of give you an idea. I'm hoping I don't drop these. There's these. That was fun putting all these in top loaders. Which I had to order because I ran out. Uh, so that's base inserts parallels. And then I have another stack, uh, of kind of my, more of my favorite ones, uh, that I'll show off real quick. And I also picked these up. Uh, I didn't know they ever made one of these, uh, because most of you may or may not be aware, but the Broncos did sign Jerry Rice to a one year contract, uh, I don't remember what year for him to officially retire from the game. Uh, but out of uh, 2005 Upper Deck Reflections, got a Jerry Rice jersey card in a Broncos uniform for the Broncos PC. So that's pretty sweet if you ask me. A uh, couple autos in a Broncos uniform that I didn't have. Well, this one I didn't have in a Broncos uniform. But uh, out of Upper Deck, I guess this is Upper Deck Legends, Floyd Little. And then... Uh, out of Upper Deck MVP, year is 99, uh, Pro Sign, John Mobley, on card autograph. So another auto that I didn't have for the Broncos collection. So there's those. I'm trying to move some stuff out of the way because, like I said, I mean, I've, I've got stuff all over the place. Uh, on to some of the inserts and uh, parallels and stuff. I'm going to kind of go through these kind of quick because it is kind of a stack but I'm not going to throw out all the years on all of these by any stretch because I'll probably get them wrong and I know Dave Josh Johnson will correct me 96 uh, Bowman's Best Refractage 97 Stadium Club uh, Triumvirate Atomic Refractor this should be 99 99 Tops Chrome uh, Record Numbers Refractor 98 Bowman Chrome Refractor. This should be 99 or 2000. 
think they actually put this out in 99. 99 Tops Finest Super Bowl uh, kind of promo refractor. Hidden Gems out of Tops Chrome Refractage. Uh, season's Best Refractage. Like I said, I'm going to kind of go through these. Stadium Club Chrome Never Compromise Refractor. Uh, what they call this? Award something. I don't even remember now. But 1200 Yard Club Refractor. I know these aren't really showing up very well. 99 Chrome Refractor. Pacific Blue Hollow Foil, 95 or 96, I believe. 96 Invincible. Uh, score Initial Steps. Sweet card. Action Packed Studs. Got the Diamond Flake in the earring there. Uh, 97 Donner's Preferred. Uh, Platinum Cut to the Chase. Night Games Prism. Holographic Prism, number to 250. Uh, inside the Numbers Die Cut. Out of Prestige. Sweet card. Upper Deck Star Attractions. 97. 97 Stadium Club. Uh, Tri Everett. Uh, the other version. Flare Showcase, Row Zero, sick card. Uh, showed this in the last video as far as the gold team, but the certified gold team, this is just a regular insert. Nothing too great about this one other than I think it's a sweet-ass card. Out of Revolution, Thorn in the side, or Thorn in my side, Thorn in the side, I think. Die cut up at the top, foil. Uh, tops Laser, Bright Spots. You can see my finger running through the top. So die cut there. Uh, 96 Flare Ultra Rainbow. Parallel. That completes all of those. Uh, Aurora Blue Hollow Foil. Numbered 2. Probably can't see that. Number to 100. 95 uh, Crown Blue Hollow Foil. Sweet card. Uh, Pacific Invincible, the rainbow, base, red, silver, and blue, and then uh, silver, red, and bronze on, uh, I think this is Dynagon, Dynagon, however you want to say it, 97 Pacific Revolution, showed a couple of these in a few videos ago, this is the bronze, and that's the red. So now I have all of those. On to the numbered cards. Uh, 99 uh, Prism. Uh, purple. Number to 320. Uh, 99 Aurora. Uh, what is this? Uh, Championship Fever. This is uh, the blue hollow foil. Number 2 of 100. Uh, upper Deck. Uh, I don't know what they even call this one. Uh, upper Deck Exclusives. This is, I guess, one of the parallels. It's number 200. You can barely see it down there. Uh, 2001 Titanium. Uh, premiere date, 81 and 99. Uh, 2000 Aurora. Premiere date, number to 85. Blue Hollow Foil, 90, uh, 2000 Paramount, numbered to 75. This one's pretty sweet. Uh, serial number to 65, same year uh, premiere. Uh, I don't know exactly what they call this from a variation perspective, but it is serial number 30 of 65, which is jersey number. Uh, 2000 Quantum Leaf Star Factor. Number 37 of 50. You probably barely saw that. Uh, 2001 Impressions. 34 of 50. And then the shortest print. Well, almost the shortest print when it comes to inserts and parallels. Uh, SPX from 2000. Number 10 of 25. So that's kind of the... 
the cooler ones, the number ones. Uh, also got and picked up a couple printing plates from Pacific. <clears throat> These are pretty sweet. These are from the uh, the 2002 uh, Chicago National. Uh, these are all 2001 cards. We've got Donneris Classics, Playoff Honors, and then Score Select. These are all numbered to five, so pretty sweet to get those into the collection. Uh, next, we got jerseys. 15 minutes, and I still got a ton of stuff to go through. I'm going to throw go through these kind of quick. Uh, Donner's Classics. Uh, Pacific Private Stock, number to 60. Tools of the Trade, Jersey, Shoe, and Pants, number to 30. Playoff Momentum. Uh, Collector's Edge Game Care Quads. This is the shoe. Pretty sweet. Uh, Tools of the Trade, Jersey, number to 100. Piece of the Game, Football. Fabric of the Game, Superstar Materials, no number. Haven't seen that one before. Absolute Memorabilia, Marks of Fame, number 2150. Leaf Limited, uh, Round Numbers, Bulger, and TD, number 250. 04, Hog Heaven, uh, Hog of Fame, Silver, Jersey, number 75. Fabric of the Game, number 200. I believe this is the uh, retail version um, out of uh, Playoff Momentum. These are the, the team jersey, home and away. Home and away. Uh, another Collector's Edge. Game Ball. 01 Invincible, uh, number to 250 jersey. 99, oh no, I lied, 2001, uh, Donner's Elite, face-to-face, uh, -face, the quad face mask pieces, number 200, uh, totally certified, 2011, totally certified, stitches in time, quad jersey, number to 150, Elway, McCaffrey, TD, and Shannon Sharp. Uh, 2000 Absolute Memorabilia, Groundhogs, piece of the shoe. Number to 135. Uh, Leaf Rookies and Stars. Dress for Success. Shoe. Number 250. Upper Deck Encore. Piece of the Helmet. Not numbered. Donner's Preferred. Piece of the Helmet. Number to 120. Fabric of the Game. Jersey number die cut. This is Pants. Uh, I said jersey number die cut. Huh. Well, jersey number die cut in his pair of pants, number to 30, 26 to 30. Uh, 05, no, 06, uh, Donner's Threads. This is the Dynasty Triple Jersey, Elway, TD, and Rod Smith, number to 250. Uh, fabric of the Game again, uh, football die cut pants, number to 50. 2010, 2011. It says 2011. I think this is 2010. Uh, number to 99, Timeline, Davis Cutout. Finally got a hold of that one. 05, Certified, Mirror Red, Jersey, number to 100. Fabric of the Game, uh, Debut Year Cutout, Jersey, number to 95. 2005, Donner's Classics, Classic Combos. This is a sweet card. Uh, Gail Sayers and TD, Dual Jersey, number to 75. Uh, certified again, debut year cutout, number 295. And then uh, another fabric of the game, uh, Bronco head, or they what they call uh, logo, uh, team logo cutout jersey, number 17 of 25. So that's just kind of some of the base jerseys and game used. Going on 19 minutes. These are the multicolors. Uh, 2001 Leaf Rookies and Stars slideshow. Three color, number to 100. 
Fabrica the Game uh, Century, three color, numbered 11 of 21, sit card. Uh, piece of the Game, uh, third down, two color, numbered to 50. And this replaces the one that I have in my current collection that's a single color, so two color from O2 Piece of the Game. Uh, premium Team, Game Worn Jersey, this is two color. Uh, 2001 Honors Game Day jerseys. Uh, this actually replaces the one I currently have in the collection, but it is a three color. This is just a sweet card. This thing is bulging out of the card. Uh, fabric of the Game, uh, three color, uh, jersey number, die cut, numbered to 30. And one of the sickest cards in the entire pickup. Uh, 2001 Quantum Leaf Hardware. And yes, it is numbered to 100. But check that out. NFL logo from the helmet. That is freaking sick. So there's that. On to the actual patches. 21 minutes. I'm trying to get through this. Uh, Leaf certified materials. Uh, 21st century materials. Three color patch. Number to 21. Leaf certified. O2. Mirror gold. Three color. Number to 25. Uh, private stock 2001, three color, number to 100. Technically a jersey, but older years, it's kind of sweet to get the multicolors. Uh, absolute memorabilia, this is the Absolute Heroes three color patch, number to 25. Uh, heads update, uh, 215 out of 250. This does say Game Worn Patch, so this is a three color. Uh, Pacific Vanguard patch variation edition, eight of twenty-five, three color of Mike Anderson, and three color of TD. So that's a sick card. O five leaf certified mirror gold patch, three color to twenty-five. O six national treasures, uh, prime jersey, uh, three color old school jersey, number two twenty-five. Catching the theme here, all number to twenty-five. Uh, 06 National Treasures, uh, Timeline MVP, uh, one color, three color, two color, number to 25. I have multiple of this card, but I didn't have just a regular patch version. Uh, don't really know what the heck this comes from because it's red, so the only thing I can think of is potentially Georgia. But uh, 2010 uh, Certified Fabric of the Game, number to 50. This is, uh, I'll save that one. Uh, Tools of the Trade, 2010 Absolute. Uh, jersey Helmet Jersey. So this is Georgia Jersey, piece of the helmet, and Broncos triple patch, number to 25. I think this is in result to when Fleer went out of business, and this kind of started circulating, but uh, three-color patch, uh, Fleer Premium. So let's say game use patch. Hand numbered six of a hundred. This is by far one of my favorites. Uh, 2006 uh, Absolute Tools of the Trade uh, piece of the helmet, three color prime patch pants and shoe. Numbered four of six. So that is a sick ass card. And then uh, finally, 05 uh, certified. Mirror Emerald, what up? This film not yet rated. Uh, two color, uh, this is, I believe they call the AFC NFC die cut two color patch. Number two of five. So, pretty sick patch and multicolor editions. And then on to the final piece, the autographs. This was a uh, mail order collectible, but sweet card. Uh, didn't have it. It is technically certified, so in the Georgia Uni on card, why not add it to the collection, right? Uh, 2000 Prestige Super Bowl MVP award winning signatures on card. Been wanting one of these for a while. Finally got it. Uh, this should be 02. Oh, nope, 2000 Upper Deck Legends. I have a 
uh, redemption from 2002 UD Legends for this exact card that's numbered, uh, that's not technically listed uh, as part of uh, the checklist through Beckett, but I didn't know they made one. Just a regular autograph, so on card, sick. And then finally from 2013, uh, Fleer Retro, uh, the other autograph from that year, on card, Terrell Davis. So, there you have it. 25 minutes. Uh, hopefully you stuck through the whole thing. Uh, thanks again for watching, everybody. I really do appreciate it. Jeremy, uh, looking forward to uh, touching base again sometime in the near future. Uh, Chris, thanks again for the package. I really do appreciate it, my friend. Uh, I'll let you know on the, uh, the inserts and stuff um, in the snap case. Uh, but that's all I have. Thanks for sitting through this. I know it was a lot of stuff to cover, but uh, hope all of you guys enjoyed seeing the uh, the pickups. Other than that, that's all I have. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Peace.